check it out the void. Fine. We can see how long you stay on the throttle. Just don't blink. I can't exactly care what happens to me, alright? If I can save everyone else, that's more important. You don't know what you speak of, ever. stay with Clarissa. They like each other a lot. But Michael's dead. How could I even... Whoa, wait, what? what's happening? Hello? Are you... Look, is someone there? Jonas, if you're still there, this would be a great time to say something. Don't let Jonas talk to his mom. It's not good for him. His mom's dead. I know his mom's dead. W what is... H how is this possible? W what's going on? <sighs> well, that could have gone better. <sighs> right. Time loop. Tell Michael he should go out on his own. What does this... What does this matter? He's dead. He's not... He's not here. Oh, hey, I didn't even know you were home. You're always so quiet. It's like living with a little fairy tale mouse. Wait, did I get booted back in time? I know, I haven't used this desk in like a year, but Dad has all his gear on the kitchen table, so I've been like struggling with this stupid speech, the graduation thing. I don't want it to be just the usual blah blah we've come so far type stuff. It should have like a point, right? It should bring you to your feet about something. I... I don't know. I, I don't think it has to have a point. Well, that's where we differ, sister. I think things should have points. Things should be sharp. They should poke you. I'm guessing mom probably told you about my scholarship to state, right? I don't really know how I feel about it. I mean, I feel it's not like it's a bad thing. It's a good thing, obviously. What? That's great. Congratulations. I, I mean, that that's awesome. <laughs> uh, thank you. Thanks. It's just, you know, it seems like half the teachers are alumni and... 
Actually, I'm about to be really arrogant and presumptuous and say mean things for no real reason other than I think I know better, so forget it. I've bored you enough. I'm boring me I'm right- listening. Come on, I'm not gonna judge. No, no, really. I'm talking out of my ass. It's fine. Listen, here's the- <sighs> You can't tell mom or dad, but Clarissa and I are talking about just leaving. Getting an apartment somewhere and-, and... Oh, Wow, that's- that's exciting. This is like a huge deal, like- like the boxcar children version of getting married or something. Uh, it's... Yeah, it's kind of a big deal, I guess. It'll be a lot harder to break up, so... There's some level of, uh, Val there. She's been really pushing for it, wanting to look for places, and, uh... I'm into the idea. I really am. I just... I wouldn't feel right about it if I didn't have your, like, blessing first. So, can you just wave your hand over my head or something and say I'm alright to do this? I... God, it's hard for me to say since I love you, of course, but... You should do it. Totally. Even if it explodes in a nuclear war-style breakup, you'll regret never trying. Thanks. That means a lot. Alex, just get good friends, okay? And when you're with those friends, just say yes to everything. And keep away from boys when you talk to them, it feels like you're performing. But also, stay away from girls who look you in the eye for too long. And match every beer with a water. And take classes outside of school. Classes you don't need. This is just... This is a just-in-case package, okay? Just in case I'm not around. And I love you, and you're amazing, and that's it. So... I love you too. But soon, I shall be so I cannot remember any but the things that never happened. Yeah, I... I don't know. Hey, she's waking up. Hey! Maybe don't get up immediately. Ugh. Ouch. Is, um, <clears throat> is everyone doing all right? Still, um, yourselves? Yeah, I think we're all accounted for, right? Yeah, my arm fell asleep. Jonas but... carried you here. Yeah, he said you were heavier than you looked. Yeah, 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 okay. The, the important thing is, whatever you did in the cave, it worked. The tear, the hole, it's fixed. The ghosts are gone. We're going home. Or at least they've... they've stopped trying to eat our souls. Yeah, it's important to note that. Jonas, what happened to you in the shelter? I was so... I just saw you disappear. I didn't... I didn't know what to think. What happened? I thought I heard my mom. And when Alex, when we tried to tune into this signal, I was... I don't know what it looked like from your end, but... It was like I'd fallen into a memory with my dad. I don't know. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have set us off course or whatever. I think... <sighs> Jonas, I think that was your dad. Like, it was real. You were back then. That's... I mean, it felt real, so... I don't know. Maybe. When I was under them, I had something like that, too. Did anyone else... Did anyone... I'm sorry, but, like, did anyone have dreams or whatever about the past when they were, uh, taken during the night? Um, yeah. Yeah, a few. Just, um, just the one, I think. I guess, Michael? If it was a dream, but uh, I don't know. So Michael visited you. He crawled out from whatever netherworld swamp he's in and plucked into your head? I I don't think it's like a visit, like it's making a, a conscious choice to come mess with you. You were just exhaled somewhere, time-wise. Yeah, I guess the universe doesn't choose to do anything. It just does. I can't believe everything that happened. I just... I feel like we should tell everyone we know. Like, go on a freaking book tour, but... Let's make a pact to, to just keep it, like, ours. It's only our thing. It happened to us, and nobody else has to be involved. No, Alex, we don't need a pact. We actually don't need to ever talk to each other ever again. I don't know. Like it or not, we've had a... have a shared thing now. Shared insane thing that I don't think will get reset once, like, graduation hits or something. Hey, is this your book? Oh, man. This is... We're gonna be the best couple ever. Uh, okay. Slow down. I lost it on the way. I thought for sure some commuter would have just tossed it overboard. Hey, or... that reminds me. What were we... We were talking about something stupid right before Alex woke up. Prom? Uh, uh, prom. 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 I am definitely skipping this one. I'm deferring the crown to that wheelchair girl. Are you going, Alex? Are we supposed to still spike the punch or just bring in flasks? I mean, do they even have punch? I guess. I mean, if I find a date, you know. I'm not gonna go stag. I have my dignity. Ben Owens will ask you, 
Or rather, he's going to ask you unless I physically prevent him. Eh, you can do better. All right, you know what? It's picture time. Oh my god, come on. Nona. <sighs> yeah, I guess we should. Tonight's been, um, noteworthy. Noteworthy. That is a way to say it. Yeah, I'd probably say it another way. Let's, um, let's actually move outside so we can get the light. Sure. Ren, what is that book, anyway? I don't know. I can hardly make heads or tails out of what the hell he's talking about half the time. Here's good for the... yeah, just here. Like, look. I'll just pick a random-ass page. Like, this, here. When I was younger, I could remember anything, whether it happened or not. But soon, I shall be so I cannot remember any but the things that never happened. Yeah, I... I don't know. Okay, everyone. All right, shut up. Cheese. And... Before we'd left, I told my mom I was spending the night at a friend's house. And when I got back, I didn't see any reason to change that story. And you know what? I still don't. The island did one good thing, forcing Ren and Nona together. Which is nice, because they're still together, actually, though they go to different schools now. Trying out the long distance thing, I guess. Clarissa fled to the East Coast, dropped out of college, and works at a boutique. I hear she's scared of the ocean now. Jonas was the first to introduce me as his sister. You know, without the step part in front of it. And it was weird at first, but it's the truth. He's my brother. He goes to school in town, and we see each other a lot. It's funny. What happened on the island used to pop into my head every single day. And then every other day. And then a week went by, and I realized... I hadn't thought about it at all. I guess that's... I don't know. It's good, I think. But anyways, I, um... Well... If it matters. I decided to stay in town and go to college here. It's practically up the road, and... I just wanted something familiar, I guess. But anyways... What time is it? Yeah, sorry, I gotta run or I'll miss the ferry. Ren's dragging me out to Edwards Island for that yearly beach party thing. And I have to pick up what's-his-name Jonas, too. Ugh, I hope he's not weird or mean or something. Whatever, I'm sure it'll be fun. It's something to do, right? Okay, and we're meeting who again? My sister, Allison. It's just that I just thought you said the last ferry leaves in like half an hour. It does, but look, Allie owes me big for the lawnmower thing that I promised to keep in the forever secrets land, and she, she knows how important tonight is. So she will definitely come here, and she will definitely buy us whatever we want with her very believable fake ID. Oh, I'm, I, I'm not worried. Wait, I never heard about a lawnmower thing. What lawnmower thing? Well... I swore I wouldn't talk about it. So, it just involves Randall still missing gerbil and a lot of blade cleaner. Wait. Wait, what? I said I wouldn't say anything. Don't pressure me. Uh, uh, uh forget I asked. Hey, I want on the record that whatever you're thinking right now is your own personal extrapolation. So I'm still in the clear, keeping secrets wise. <laughs> sure. Are we... I heard something about an island. Don't spoil it. Don't spoil it! I want to give you, like, the grand summation once we're underway. If Allie would ever get here... Okay, here's the... Okay, okay. Alex, bring out the radio, tune to a random station, and if somebody's talking, we'll give her another five minutes. But if it's music, we'll break off now. We'll let the stupid universe decide if stupid Allie is gonna get here or not. So, like, any station... Well, all right. I guess that means... Alex, this is... 
is some hardcore craziness. Alex, I don't even know how you convinced Carly to let you record some spooky ass message for tonight, but good friggin' job. That was amazing. Seriously, Jonas, do you know who you have as a new sister? I have goosebumps! Feel my arm. What does this mean? What do you mean, what does it mean? Wait, you're honestly telling me that you don't have anything to... Oh my God, I don't even know why I'm playing into this. Is that where we're supposed to go? Edwards Island? Yeah, that's where we're supposed to go, but... Look, Alex, you didn't have to go through all this trouble if you just wanted to sit in my den and watch that Swedish cartoon about the donkey carpenter for the 800th time instead. You know, you could have just said, Ren, let's not spend the night on a forbidden beach filled with wonder and mystery. No, wait, Ren, it's... I had nothing to do with this. I don't care. We can still... We can still go. Really. No, it's fine. Honestly, we're probably too late to catch the last boat anyway. And... Well, to be honest, I don't even think anybody else was going to go. So, you know, we probably spared ourselves a lame night, truthfully. Thanks for nothing, Allie. You older sister witch. Jonas, there's a pizza place across the street from my house that's like the best. New York, Chicago, they can all go and play with their butts for all I care because nobody can touch Alfredo's, swear to God. <laughs> all right, cool. Sounds good. And you guys, you guys just met tonight, right? Yeah, I'd been out of school and... You know, the timing just hadn't worked out. And what are you to him, Alex? 